quick step, has won stage 2 of the 2023 Criterium du Dauphiné, his first world tour win in 14 months, in an uphill bunch sprint. Richard Carapas, F Education Easy Post, surged ahead on the groupie uphill finish at La Chase Dieu, but a LaFellip timed his move perfectly to claim the victory by over bike length. Carapas settled for second, with Trek Segafredo's natural dispatch seen in third. After La Phillips' 2023 Classics season got off to a poor start at Milan, San Remo then became a virtual write off following any injury at the Tour of Flanders. A La Phillips gesture as he crossed the line spoke volumes about the importance of his first victory since February. It was a tough victory to get, a La Phillips said afterwards about the third Dauphine stage win of his career and first since 2019. These last few months have been tough, but we've worked hard and got back to where we wanted. It's a relief. I was surprised to be up there because first we were working for, teammate, Ethan Vernon, but in the end it was too tough for him, so we could have gone with Florian Sinichal, but with the kilometer to go Florian told me he was already going all out. I had good legs, so I went for it instead. Ala Phillips win represents a notable drop in pressure for the two-time world champion after his challenging start to 2023 in the 2022 campaign blooded by crashes, notably his nasty crash at Liege Bastoni Liege. Following his first World Tour victory since the stage of 2022 in its Uli Basque country, he'll now look to see if he can double his victory tally in the days to come. Now the wind's in the bag, that's great news, Ala Phillips said. I can take the rest of the week a bit more calmly and see what more I can do. Approaching the finish. Carab is the F education writer to make a brief dash for the line at 700 meters to go then for another. Carab is to make a late attempt to surprise the fast men on the short finishing straight. The Ecuadorian's ambitions quickly fizzled out and only served as a springboard, though, for Ala Phillips to time his run with perfection to claim France's second win in two days, and one with a great dose of personal redemption. Thanks legends and I hope you are all well. Don't miss a moment from the sports that you follow. Help us to bring you the best content possible. Please share, like, and subscribe.